Okay. Um, my name is Jebun Haruna. I am a tour guide at the Wichel Community Hippo Sanctuary and also the assistant manager. And right here I am in the Blackwater River. Going down to my right, you are going south of the river. And to my left, you are going up to the north. And the motive behind the protection of the hippos is that first we want to conserve the hippos because the species of hippos is going on extension and we are fortunate to have hippos in Ghana and fortunately the hippos are found within the Wichel Paramancy and we are protecting the hippos. Another reason why we are protecting the hippos is that we want to protect the hippos so that we will use that as a tourism site. By doing tourism, we will get proceeds from the project and that is what we are going to use in developing the communities. And actually the Wichel Community Hippo Sanctuary is a community-based project which was started in 1998 by the chiefs opinion leaders and other stakeholders around the Wichel Pharmacy. And 20 communities came together to establish this project. So all the benefits that comes out from the project goes back into these 20 communities that is running at the project. And we actually have some few challenges, even though we are getting more benefits. Some of the benefits include People are getting scholarships from junior high schools to senior high schools. Communities are getting clean drinking water. And also, we are doing a Shea Butter project. And over 1,000 women are included in this project. And talking about the challenges, we have the natural environment where the hippos live and the hippos depend solely on the environment during the dry season one of the challenges we are facing is people to booze burning booze burning they set fire into the booze which the hippos depend on as their source of food because hippos are herbivores they feed on plants and grasses and then sometimes we have people going into the river and then swimming the rest to the Not hippos in general, but some of the plant mammals that we have within the forest. You can talk of the bulls, but you can talk of the antelopes, you can talk of the rabbits. And we also protect plants and animals. That is just some few stories about the hippos and also the people around the hippo sanctuary they don't actually need a place for the hippos because the hippos help them to escape war. What happens during the war? The leaders of the communities pray to their ancestors, to their lesser gods to protect them to escape this war. So what they did was they did sacrifices by using chicken and local drinks to do sacrifice. So when they ran down to the Blackwater River, those days you were not having canoes, you were not having boats. So what happened was the hippos came out in their numbers and then they formed a bridge and then they were walking on the hippos and then cross. But when the enemies were coming, so they also got to the river and they also saw the bridge. So they were walking up on the hippos. So in the middle of the river, the hippos dived down. That is, was the time they realized that all oh, those were not normal bridge. They were hippos and then the people who got down, got drowned and then they died. So the other people who were able to cross 
to the other side of the river said, okay, we are safe. So the, the generation to follow us, we are not going to eat the flesh of the hippos. So that is the most reason why the people around the Wichio community, Hippo Central, find it necessary to conserve the hippos. See you soon.